What's up? Jim here. Welcome back to J Street Moto. Welcome to the channel if it's your first time. So today is a big day in the Charlotte metro area. It's actually a big weekend. We got two huge events happening. One is this thing called The Congregation. And it happens at this place called Camp North End in the Charlotte metro area. I am gonna talk about the show in a little more length while I'm sitting down on the patio. So stick around. It's really kind of hard to get good audio in uh, the, the Camp North End, North End location. Uh, so I really couldn't talk about the bikes I was seeing. I'm gonna drop some of them in here as I kind of tell y'all what the vibe is of the show. It's kind of what I want y'all to get. Cause if you're, you know, if you're in the Charlotte area and it's, you know, beginning of October, might be a cool thing for you to check out. They have tons of vendors there. Let me start first by saying, Congregation is put on by Prism Supply. And for those of you that don't know who that company is, uh, they not only build like custom old school bikes, uh, but they also produce parts that you can buy and use to customize your own bike. I personally don't build motorcycles, but I'm really into checking out the work that other people did. So um, Congregation's a place for me to do that. And it's a place for me to connect with old friends and stuff, because I usually see a lot of people there that that you know I see at other times throughout the year. Some of them, that's the only time I see them is at that show. So it's really pretty cool. And I'm kind of dropping in throughout this video or while I'm talking, some of the bikes that really caught my eye while I was there. Uh, the facility that this show is in is massive. It's a big facility, it's a huge venue, and well, at the end of the day, the bikes are scattered kind of throughout, so there's little surprises around kind of every corner that you turn in. Um, they've got classic cars, vans, um, hot rods, uh, even low riders. I saw two low riders there today. I think I think I've got video of them. If I do, I'll drop it in here. Um, it's just a celebration of everything that is internal combustion engines. I saw people pinstriping helmets there, which was really cool. Harley had some of their more uh, customized bikes, so the newer models, out and and you know there to to for people to view. Uh, one in particular that I saw that was really freaking cool was the bike owned by one of the band members in Slipknot, and it was a sick looking motorcycle. I'm not kidding. I did get a video of that one, and um, I'll drop it in, you know, here, so you can see it. Uh, I tried to capture as much detail as I could on the bikes while I'm walking around and not getting in people's ways, you know. Uh, there were vendors there. Prism had a, Prism had a, sh you know, they had a booth there for both their merch and their, their, you know, what they're about and their parts. Uh, Foundation Moto. Adam and the guys from Foundation Moto had a booth set up for, um, for their merch and they had several bikes in the show, quite honestly. That's a huge thing that makes this a big deal in the Charlotte area. Today's Saturday, and today was congregation. Tomorrow's Sunday. And tomorrow is the Goose Creek Airport event supporting the Road to the OTR, or the Old Town Revival. That's hosted by Foundation Moto. Um, both of those are huge events, and for them to partner together to do it on the same weekend is incredible. So tomorrow I'm heading out to Goose Creek to see that, you know, check out that venue. And uh, it's gonna be less of a bike show and more of a, uh, more high octane is a good way to put it. They're gonna have a couple of cars out there doing drift exhibitions on the runway. Uh, they're gonna have a motorcycle stunt show. I hope to get some footage of that. And then, you know, because we're at a runway and we own the runway for the day, uh, we usually drag race down it, and I'm gonna try and capture, capture some footage of that as well. Um, I do not yet know whether this is gonna be one video that shows both events kinda together, or whether it's gonna be two separate videos, an episode for each event. Ended up deciding to do an episode for Congregation and an episode for Goose Creek. So make sure you come back next week, the week after this video drops, in order to see the Goose Creek footage, because that's gonna be interesting too. 
Uh, another thing they had, they have, they've had it the past couple of years at Congregation, they have the Globe of Death. Uh, if you've ever been to a rally, you've seen this. It's, uh, it's that big spherical cage where they put a couple of dirt bikes in there and they're running around and flipping upside down and stuff. I did video that and I'm going to drop it in right here for you guys to see it. Yeah, so that's it. That was what Congregation was like. I hope you got a feel for it. Uh, I hope if you're in the Charlotte area, if you live here, this is something you certainly need to put on your calendar for next year. Be, be on the lookout for it. Um, it's usually all over Facebook. For sure, if you go and, and follow uh, Foundation Moto on Facebook or Instagram, you will see alerts about when this show is gonna happen and it'll it'll let you know uh it's a really cool vibe and i suggest you check, suggest you check it out okay that's it for this one uh again come back next week to see what's going to happen tomorrow at goose creek do me a favor like subscribe click the notification bell share it with your friends all that stuff's free to you and it helps the channel always ride safe yeah right one two three shoot ah. Asshole. Really? <laughs> Peace out, bitches! <laughs>